guys, welcome back to my channel, Duke Doo's Toy Lab. Today, I have a tie-dye kit with me. And I decided I'm going to tie-dye one shirt for me and another shirt for my little sister. In this kit I bought, there are three different colors. They're called the Moody Blues. It, they are uh, turquoise, green, and blue. Did you know that there are many different different types of tie-dye designs we can put on shirts? Like the spiral, stripes, stripes, crumble, and bullseye. The bullseye just looks like what a normal bull's like, bull's eye will look like. A dot in the middle and circles around it. We can dye up to nine projects. And all we have to do is just add water to the dye and then we're ready to dye, tie dye. This is the spiral. And then this is the stripes. This is the crumble and the bullseye. Let's unbox it. Okay, so first, we have to rip this. Whoa, this is really hard. Is there like a tiny opening or something? Oh, this is really hard. Now it is open. Here are the dies. Three of them. Rubber bands. Gloves. And instruction manual for the different types of designs. And that's all. So we need to apply water to the dye up to the neck part right here. Should show a line. And then we just put we just put your design on this on here. And then apply your dye. Let it sit for six to eight hours. I'll put it for like 24 hours. And then wash it, get the extra dye off. And then let that dry for another like an hour and then it's done so let's do just that see right there there's like a powder that's the green powder and when we add the water until the neck area it will turn to dye we just have to shake it and it will turn to dye same with the other bottles there's a powder in the bottom and when we add water it will turn to dye Hmm, which tie-dye method should I use? Bullseye, swirl, ombre, or crumble? Whoa! Look at that, look at the spiral. It's right there. That looks really cool. I'll do the spiral one. It looks really cool. Let's see. Pinch fabric and twist into a flat spiral. Okay, so basically we do this with the shirt. And then bind it, and if you don't know what that means, it means just add the rubber bands. And then apply dye, and then let it dry. And that's it. That seems simple enough. Let's do it. We're gonna make the swirl. So pinch. Make sure it's very tight. Okay. There we go. We have the swirl. Our swirl is ready. Now let me add the rubber bands. We are done with the spiral. This is the front. This is the back. Now let's apply the dye. And it's my first time tie-dyeing, so I don't know how it's gonna turn out. Like, I don't know. Seriously. Okay, so 
Let's start tie-dyeing. I've got my gloves on. Now, starting with turquoise. Okay, now let's do the other side. We're gonna put it into this dry cover plastic bag. Okay, now we... Next, let's tie down my little sister's shirt. For my little sister's shirt, I'm going to do the crumble method. It's very easy. All we have to do is crumble it up, put rubber bands on it, and tie-dye. And that's it. Let's crumble it. So, you just crumble it. Like this. It's not that hard. Let's add the rubber bands. Okay, first one is in. Then the second one. Is in. Let's start tie-dyeing. Okay. Wait. First, I'll put this right here. And then, get these two, and then, tie-dye. Now, combine some. Make sure they go deep in. I'm just combining these two because... These two colors look pretty cool. Now we flip it, then do it on this side. Gonna add a little bit of blue on this side. Okay, that's enough blue. Now we add it around. Okay, well, the dye's all done and her shirt is all done tie-dyeing. Now let's put it in a bag and set it for drying. Okay, now it's in there. Let's put it for drying. So, we will look back at these shirts after eight hours and if it's not dry, I'll put it for a little, like two more hours. And if it is dry, I'll wash off the extra um, tie dye that's on there. And then we'll set that for drying and then we'll be done. It has been 24 hours since I left these t-shirts for drying. Now let us see if they are dry. This is my t-shirt. Whoa, look at all these colors. This is pretty dry. Now I'm gonna put this aside. Now, my little sisters. I think hers looks better than mine, not gonna lie. And this is dry as well. Now, let us wash these and take off all of the extra dye. This 
is my little sisters. Kind of looks like the earth. A ton of green, a ton of light blue, a little bit of blue. Let's put both of these shirts for dry. Did you like my tie-dye video? If you did, smash that like button and subscribe. Bye!